What is flow? Flow is a concept discussed by author Mihaly Csikszentmihalyi in his book Flow, The Psychology of Optimal Experience. According to him, flow is a state in which people are so involved in an activity that nothing else seems to matter. The experience itself is so enjoyable that people will do it even at great cost, for the sheer sake of doing it. Let's consider two examples. Have you been in situations where you sit down to write about something for a few minutes? But after a few minutes, you continue to get a lot of ideas so that you couldn't stop writing? Have you heard of people who kept gambling after they have already won a lot of money and lost everything in the end? This is due to the flow state we experience in certain activities in certain scenarios. Once we get into the flow state, the activity feels easier, time seems to be flying, and we enjoy doing the activity. In the first example, when we get into a flow state, we get lots of ideas for writing, that would have taken days, if we were working in the normal state. Also, we will be able to easily connect the different ideas and create a well structured outcome, rather than having to think about a bunch of unrelated ideas. In the second example, the man who was gambling should have stopped gambling after winning a lot of money, considering the risk of losing. Yet such people keep on gambling as they feel they are in a flow state and they can win everything. Even when they start losing, they still want to gamble and experience the enjoyment in flow state despite losing money. Flow state can be both good and bad for us based on the activity. In the gambling example, flow is affecting us in a bad way, even though we will still be enjoying it. In the writing example, flow is helping us in a good way to write quickly as well as improve the quality. Once we are in the flow state, we feel the difference, even though we are not recognizing it as flow. We know that it's difficult to get into the same state, if we stop now and start again later. Therefore, we like to keep it going regardless of the consequences. So, it's important to identify activities that get us quickly into flow state. Then, we have to take necessary actions to continue activities that gives positive flow and eliminate activities that gets us to negative flow. So, what are the activities that gets you quickly to flow state? Let us know in the comment section. Subscribe to our channel for more videos on personal development and personal development books.